better. It seemed like the rebound situation a lot better. Overall, just a better game today. Just thoughts on going from a night where nothing seemed to go right to today, where you guys managed to see some improvement across the board to a certain degree. I think over every young team, we, uh, our team was young, and the first game of getting everybody into it and confidence was a good with it. Everybody get the, everybody was nervous the first game, and then confidence had a lot to do with it. What did you guys say that too? Was that a big thing on Friday night to today? Was just you know getting that first one out of the way and just getting some measure of confidence. Yeah, back. yeah, they lost it tough, but it's a long season. We got to put that behind us and focus on the next one. What was the difference today offensively? It seemed like, like I said, everybody shooting a little bit better today. Everybody getting a little bit more in rhythm today than, than maybe at least just based on the numbers. Can you just talk about the difference between the offense from well, then to now? And yeah, everybody like really sharing the ball, you know, driving and kicking. You know, crashing our offensive boards better than we did the other night. You know, that, that seemed to help us a lot, too. It seems like you guys need – there's a run there. You're tied 45-45. They're hanging around. And the press break is something that they want to do. They want to force the tempo. They want to force you guys into mistakes. You get some buckets there. You get two dunks. Lawton, I mean, Builder gets a layup. Can you just talk about the importance of that run and how do you think that, you know, changed the game? Could you kind of feel that swing things a little bit? They they closed within three or four, but they never really mounted anything after that. They never really got back in the game after that. Helped us with our, with our energy level. Uh, get a couple of steals, get a couple of easy layups, easy buckets. Yeah, so. Is this a team like last year where you guys are going to run when you have to? This isn't a group that's going to try and that isn't going to run up and down the floor the whole time. You guys are going to get in fast break situations when they present themselves. Is that kind of the, the plan? Yeah, hey, that's what we want to do. Run. We don't want to like really set up plays all the time. You know, we want to get easy buckets. We don't want to work hard, too hard. We just want to get easy buckets in transition. What's the difference in rebounding? You know, the offensive rebounds still maybe aren't where you guys want them, but you guys still get 36 and you control the defensive glass. How important was it just to limit second chances for them? Because that, that seemed to be a big thing against Tulsa, at least when, when you look over the numbers. That was a big challenge for us. Uh, coming out of the Tulsa game, it was a big, we put a big emphasis on that. You too. I mean, you, you and Chuck were doing a lot of the shooting in that first game today. When I, when I look up and down the stat sheet, it, it's what Coach talked about in the preseason. You know, nobody's going to get you 20 a night, but you have 13, Chuck's got 10, and then a bunch of guys with 8, 7, 7, 6. Is that, is that what you guys need as you guys go through this? That's what we want as a team. Uh, sharing the ball is important to our team. Uh, I think having, a, um, having equal balance in scoring shows, shows a lot for our team. Could you feel, was, was there any difference in offensive execution there? Were guys feeling a little more crisp? Was there better just movement, better confidence in the offense today? Or, or what was sort of the difference from then tell now because it seemed today at times, especially early on in the game, you won that 10 2 run, there was a lot of movement, a lot of looks like you guys were passing up and better shots there down the stretch and at points in the second half, too. Um, just, just sharing the ball. Uh, we didn't, it, our offense wasn't staying, we kept moving the ball from side to side. It was easy, easy to show. The one thing I think that, that people would harp on it, it is the turnover situation a little bit. It's definitely not something you want in the foul situation, too. Putting guys in the line, you put Tulsa on the line 30 times you put. These guys on the line. Have to, how, what's been the, the? Is that just a product of trying to play defense the way you are, or has it been problems yeah, rotating in the shell? You know, we got we got nine new guys. I mean, it, it'll be tough sometimes. You know, with new guys, you know, trying to get in the spots defensively where we should be. Yeah, help, help defense is very important. But like, you know, it's a long season. We, we still got a lot of work to do, and I believe we can get better. Was that the difference with Mike and with Mike and Will today? They both had four fouls, but some of those seemed like they were either over the back trying to get over to a missed shot or trying to come help side for a block. Was that today just them trying to react a little bit and be a little yeah, over aggressive yeah. and trying to come yeah. to the help side? I mean, really you don't want you don't want the post getting good position on you. You know, they be trying with their feet really, but you know, like we still we still got a lot of work to do defending the post. Now, that, that's how they're trying to do. I mean, you can learn from mistakes. So. How tough is it to go through that process? I know you guys have them racked and stacked. You get three or four games in a tight stretch. How, how hard is it to, to you know, adapt and adjust things You know, when you have that tight of a schedule? Is it tough or is it, you know, what's, what sort of the mindset like as you go through just having this many games packed closely together? Because I know sometimes you maybe can't go back and correct as much as you want in that schedule. You've got to get ready for something else. It's, it's tough. It's tough to uh, to, to move, to transition like that. Uh, come out of junior college, I'm gonna too. Um, but in practice, that's what we have to learn. We have to learn in practice, and, and whatever we do for practice, we're going to the court. Thanks so much, guys. Thank you.